Welcome back to another wrestling update video. Today, we're diving into some huge WWE spoilers for the upcoming Monday Night Raw and trust me, there's a lot to talk about. WWE has already taped the show which means we have some major surprises and storyline developments for you. If you want to avoid spoilers, this might be a good place to pause but if you're ready to find out what's coming up, let's get into it. One of the standout matches next week is between Bronson Reed and Seth Rollins. It promises to be an intense match but here's the game changer. Bad Bloodline steps in to interfere on Reed's behalf. Thanks to Solo Sokoa and his crew, Bronson Reed is able to defeat Seth Rollins. After the match, Solo Sokoa raises Reed's hand in victory, making it clear that Reed is aligning with Bad Bloodline for the upcoming Survivor Series War Games match. This practically confirms that Rollins will join the OG Bloodline side in War Games, adding even more heat to the upcoming match. What makes this exciting is how WWE is shaping up these factions for Survivor Series. Last week, we saw Sami Zayn reaching out to Rollins about joining OG Bloodline. Now, it looks like that's set in stone. It's going to be a showdown with intense rivalries, who's ready to see OG Bloodline and Bad Bloodline collide in war games. Another major matchup lined up for next week's Raw is Brown Breaker facing off against Sheamus for the Intercontinental Championship. It starts as a solid contest, but the inning throws a wrench into the plans. Ludwig Kaiser jumps in and causes a no contest, attacking both Sheamus and Breaker. This interference leaves the Intercontinental title picture in a mess and now it's unclear who will be in line for the title shot at Survivor Series. Given that Breaker has been pushing hard for a title run, this interference only adds more tension to his rivalry with Sheamus and Ludwig Kaiser. It'll be interesting to see how this plays out in the coming weeks. We're also getting an exciting mixed tag team match with Rey Mysterio and Zelina Vega teaming up to face Chad Gable and Ivy Nile. Rey Mysterio and Zelina put up an incredible fight and ultimately, Rey secures the victory by pinning Chad Gable. This match showcases Rey's legendary skills and Zelina's determination, keeping both of them in the spotlight as we approach Survivor Series. Another huge match we'll see is the War Raiders going up against the Judgment Day. The War Raiders have been unstoppable lately and they come out on top in this battle, showing their strength and keeping their momentum going. With Survivor Series around the corner, this win might indicate that the War Raiders have bigger plans, possibly even eyeing the Tag Team Championships. Now, this is one of the biggest moments of the night. After weeks of absence, Rhea Ripley makes her surprise return at the end of the show. She goes straight for Liv Morgan, attacking her and making a huge statement. With her return, it's now confirmed that Ripley will be competing in the women's war games match at Survivor Series. Fans have been eagerly waiting for Ripley's comeback and she did not disappoint. Her involvement in war games brings even more intensity to the match and it's going to be a must-watch showdown. 6. OG Bloodline vs. Bad Bloodline War Games Setup With Rollins now confirmed to join OG Bloodline and Bronson Reed stepping in as Bad Bloodline's fifth member, the war game setup is complete. This rivalry has been building for a while and it's exciting to see these factions finally go head-to-head. -head. Sami Zayn recently teased the idea of Rollins joining OG Bloodline by tweeting an old picture of himself with Rollins and Roman Reigns, which just fueled fan anticipation. Adding Rollins to the OG Bloodline side is a game changer. His history with Roman Reigns and the Bloodline brings a lot of depth to this match. Meanwhile, Bronson Reed on the bad Bloodline side makes them even more dangerous. Survivor Series is shaping up to be an event we won't want to miss, The Rock's new GQ magazine feature. Switching gears a bit, let's talk about The Rock. He's just been named GQ Magazine's 2024 Man of the Year and will be featured as the first cover star of the year. 
The Rock has been making headlines all year long, and now he's recognized as GQ's Entertainer of the Year. This honor is well-deserved, as he continues to make waves both in wrestling and in Hollywood. And lastly, we have some big news about John Cena. Senna has announced that next year will be the beginning of his retirement tour, and he'll be making an appearance on the first Monday Night Raw of 2025. Senna's a legend, and his retirement tour is bound to be emotional for fans who have followed him for decades. He's confirmed that this tour will give fans a chance to see him one last time before he steps away from the ring. While it's sad to think about Senna retiring, it's also a chance for fans to celebrate his career and legacy. If you're a John Senna fan, this is going to be a must-watch. So, these are the major spoilers and updates for next week's Raw. There's so much to look forward to, from Seth Rollins joining OG Bloodline to Rhea Ripley's return, plus more Survivor Series developments. What do you think about these spoilers? Are you excited for Rollins to join OG Bloodline? And how do you feel about Bronson Reed joining Bad Bloodline? Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more wrestling news, updates, and rumors. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.